What we also know is that the, um, uh, those with signs of chest infections will stay in the hospital for about seven days. Um, the reason for that is they, they don't want any uh, problems to arise now that everything has gone so right with getting these boys out. They wouldn't want anything to go wrong now. And one of the interesting things that came from that uh, press conference uh, was that most of the boys had lost two kilograms of weight while they were in there. For 17 days they're in there. For nine of those days, they were on their own. They had no food, no water, no help whatsoever. And on that ninth day, they started to get in gels so that they would bring up their energy, some, some very bland food, not too much so that it wouldn't cause any problems. But two kilograms for boys of that age is a lot of weight. And so it's a really tough physical ordeal that these boys have been through. Uh, what's the significance of the location you're speaking to us from, John Joe? Well, this is the Mai Sai School, and this is where six of the wild boar football team are enrolled. This is their school. This is uh, uh, where they come in every day, and for the last 17 days, all of these people here have been waiting for the news uh, that... Uh, that these guys were going to come out. They've been waiting on tenterhooks. I've been speaking to some of their closest friends today, and they just said how elated they are about the news. One of the things was told to me is that, um, if you remember from the letters that the boys wrote to their families while they were stuck inside the cave, one of them wrote, Mum and Dad, please don't forget about my birthday party. Well, one of them mentioned it to me today. One of their friends mentioned it. They're going to have that party there, and they're going to have a lot of fun with it.